Winnebago County board members prepare to vote on a resolution opposing Illinois' new Safety Act. The act includes several changes to the criminal justice system, including getting rid of cash bail. Opponents argue it's going to make our streets more dangerous. Amory Wilder talked with one of the bill's main supporters who says there's a lot of misconceptions about the law. Amory. Eric, one county board member tells me there's a lot of support from his fellow board members to oppose the state law. Meanwhile, a lawmaker says he wants to clear up what he calls false rumors about the bill. Pre-trial fairness, that's what we're trying to uh, accomplish as a legislative black caucus. State Representative Maurice West is a member of the Illinois Legislative Black Caucus. Back in January of 2021, a piece of legislation the group backed, the Safety Act, was passed. Part of the law would eliminate cash bail. Winnebago County Board Member John Sweeney opposes the rollout. All in all, it's, it's a bill that I think um, and many of my colleagues believe are going to make society much less safe. Sweeney says his main concern is that it classifies certain violent crimes as non-detainable offenses. It's, it's almost unconscionable to think that offenses such as uh, second-degree murder or burglary um, would be, or kidnapping would be you know, crimes that you could be immediately let out um, back into society. Representative West argues that this measure will help the have-nots who are not proven guilty yet. Well, there's people in jail right now who have lost their homes, lost their relationships, lost their jobs because they were too broke to pay for their cash bail. That's what we're trying to tackle. Ending of cash bail does, that, does not mean that these individuals are now released uh, from jail on their own accord. It means that the power is right back where it's supposed to be, in the judge's hands. The judge would do a risk assessment based on the offense and determine if the defendant should be held or not. Sweeney believes it will only lead to negative results for the county and state. It emanates from Chicago politicians, quite frankly, who think that you know, their, their system of justice there, um, which has produced you know, the highest murder rate in 25 years last year, should be shared by the entire state. And um, there's a lot of us around here that is, are very against that. To West, it's about empowering all individuals, money or no money. It was a revolutionary, game-changing, piece of legislation, and those who just don't like, uh, who are okay with the status quo, don't feel like we need change, they're attacking it. According to Representative West, they are working to clean up the language of the law, and there will be a correction to the bill this upcoming session. Sweeney believes board members could vote by the 29th on his resolution asking state lawmakers to repeal the Safety Act. Eric.